Hi, I'm Nash. Today I'm going to show you how to set up a Bali fingerboard. Bali is Black River's economy label. This is the perfect start to get into fingerboarding. Let's show you how it goes. We got the deck here, real wear graphic. We're going to start by putting on the trucks. We got eight screws here. I like to punch them all in first. The holes are nicely countersunk, easy to put the screws in. I hold it down with my thumb and get the first truck and line up the base plate. I will then start using the tool provided to catch the threads. Set it down and move on to a longer screwdriver for more torque. I like to screw my trucks in in a star pattern to get even pressure and prevent stripping or an uneven truck. As you're doing this, you'll watch the base plate start to sink in and watch it go in evenly. The last thing you want to do is strip out your truck, then have to get a replacement. That looks about good. Let's do it on the other side. Perfect. Next, we'll assemble the wheels. Grab your provided nut, push it into your tool, grab the wheel, slide it on, and start tightening it up and continually checking for a slight play in the wheel. This is too much. Let's keep going. Just want a small rock so the wheel spins freely and doesn't seize. There we go. We'll do it for the other three. Just think of a pit stop. Formula One pit stop. Put it on your wheels. Check for the small play. It's a little too much. There we go. Pop the wheel. Put your nut. Now we got all four wheels, we're almost there. Each Bali board comes with an extra set of bushings. These black ones provided offer better turning, carving, and spring out of grinds. We'll leave the washer that comes with it on there and place the big one, the big O-ring on the bottom. And now we'll punch out the smaller O-ring from the hanger. Let's seat the hanger onto the base plate into the pivot cup first and over the kingpin. Place the small one. There's the nut, but that was too fast because we need to put the washer on. And there we go. Much better turning already compared to this stock assembly. Lastly, we will place on the Bali tape. Bali tape comes pre-cut, ready to rip for your fingerboard. Let's go ahead. Remove it from the adhesive backing. I like to try and catch the first part of the nose best as you can so you get a nice clean edge around the whole board. Press it nice and even. Remove any bubbles or creases. Get a kick clip. You're ready to go. That's Bali. I hope that helps you on your fingerboard journey. We'll see you on the park.